has Ron Pierce driving for the owner Martin Sharp. Number two is Pronger. Keith Oliver is in the bike owner of Ben Wallace. Isle of Patamos is number three. Owner is David Sharp, Jerry Silva. Peter Heffering and Samson Street Stables with the drive to Luke Willock. Stonebridge Galaxy 4 with Rick Zeron in the bike for Stephen Chantrant, Paul Marion, and David Shea. Five, as lucky is, as lucky does. Owned by Cliff and Herb Siegel, John Fodera, driver Mike Saftig. City Rogue 6 is owned by Kevin O'Reilly, driver Paul McDonnell. Seven Rare Jewel entering the track to parade with Brian Sears in the bike. The owner is Norm Bartania. Francis Azure, the owner, and Mark McDonald drives the eight groovy day. Phil Houdon is in the bike of nine quiet flight. The owner, Alex Gordon. Condition pace field for the seventh race. The purse, $35,000. Starts to pick three with exactor, triactor, win place, and show. Seventh race field is in motion. And here they come. And they're off and pacing. Strong start on the outside by Rare Jewel being sent on out of there. There goes Pronger. Pronger along the inside. Then over to Stonebridge Galaxy hard leaving. Next over to Lucky is as Lucky does. And Rare Jewel was widest. Brandon's Cowboy, an 8-5 to five favorite, follows off. And he left in fifth position ahead of City Rogue. Isle of Patamos is third from last ahead of Groovy Day. And Quiet Flight is the early trailer. Lucky is as Lucky does. Crossed over at the quarter, 25 and 4. Stonebridge Galaxy has worked himself into the two-hole trip position. Pronger attending the pace well from third. Rare Jewel is fourth. And that's Brandon's Cowboy landing fifth up to three-eighths completion. Six pacers back and on the way to the half is City Rogue ahead of the three-year-old Isle of Patamos. Second to last, Groovy Day and the trailer are still Quiet Flight. Quiet Flight moves to the outside from ninth. On the way to the half, Lucky is as Lucky does. Mike Saftig tapped the air brakes. Half a mile posted 54 and 1. 28 and 2 in the second quarter. Stonebridge Galaxy of Pocket Sitter, Rare Jewel, is first over. Pronger stayed in from fourth. There goes Brandon's Cowboy in the advantageous second over spot. He's up into the top five. Sixth on the outside for the final turn. That's the hard closing City Rogue, Isle of Patamos. Strictly a following trip from seventh. Eighth on the outside was Quiet Flight. And Groovy Day is not and pinned in on the cones. Lucky is as Lucky does. Comes to the top of the stretch. On the outside, Rare Jewel. Stonebridge Galaxy backing away. Second over was Brandon's Cowboy abruptly into the stretch. 122 and 2. 28 and 1 in the third quarter. Lucky is as Lucky does. Still going. Holding Rare Jewel at bay. Stonebridge Galaxy along the inside. Rare Jewel on the outside. Lucky is as Lucky does. Desperate to hold him off. Here's the wire. Rare Jewel. Got it by a head to Lucky is as Lucky does and Stonebridge Galaxy third 149 and three and Brian Sears comes right back. Virgil returned from the Woodbine seventh race. Artiscape four-year-old Bay Gelding from Michelle's Jewel, owned by Norm Bartini of Hamilton, trained by Richard Banka, and driven to victory by Brian Sears. The fifth win in 17 starts this year, 149 and 3. That's a life's mark. Rare Jewel in the seventh. Seventh race trackside blanket presentation from the special group of Humphrey Miles. Thanks and welcome to all of you from Humphrey Miles. Thanks for your trackside beautiful blanket presentation to seventh race winner Rare Jewel on North America Cup 22 night at Woodbine in Toronto.